在二十世纪初出现的近三百个美国汽车品牌中，延续至今的已是寥寥可数，其中包括别克、凯迪拉克、福特和下面将为您介绍的雪佛兰。一九一一年十一月三号，通用汽车创始人威廉·杜兰特和来自瑞士的赛车手兼工程师路易斯·雪佛兰共同创立了雪佛兰汽车公司。第一辆雪佛兰，一架高性能六缸发动机的 Classic Six， 以两千一百五十美元的不菲价格，于一九一二年底面世底特律。但一直看好低价位市场的杜兰特不顾雪佛兰的反对。于一九一四年推出了四缸汽车四九零小轿车，并以四百九十美元普通人能接受的价格，帮助雪佛兰品牌成功占领市场。一九一八年，雪佛兰被通用并购后的头一年的销量，即超过所有其他通用品牌的销量。在三十年代，雪佛兰创下了每隔四十九秒就卖出一部汽车的销售记录。It's a value brand. People can afford it. It's something that、uh, it, it's not、uh, too expensive, but it brings style,、uh, features, a driving experience that is probably worth more money than they actually、uh, have to pay. And I think that's the thing. It's always kind of over-delivering value. That's、uh, how Chevrolet started, and that's how it is 100 years later. 二十世纪中期，美国人对欧洲跑车型小轿车的着迷，又促使雪佛兰推出了凯尔维特跑车，至今有六十年历史。I think that、um, the connection that Chevrolet has with racing is、um, it's one of those things that it's, it's just expected.、Uh, this is a very passionate car company first and foremost, and, and that's what I think is exciting about how the brand has changed in the last. 20, 30 years. It's becoming much more focused on the excitement of cars, whether it's racing, whether it's buying a new car, whether it's driving the car. It's all about the passion of being an owner of a Chevrolet, and I think that racing heritage does play a nice thing into it.、Um, I don't think it necessarily sells cars for us, but it's something that we're very proud of and that we'll always want to be associated with. 一九三五年，雪佛兰推出 Suburban 卡车，这是雪佛兰历史最长的车款，并一直延续至今，也是世界最早的 SUV 之一。进入二十一世纪，原油紧缺实实在在的反映到了加油站不断上涨的标价牌中，一贯以卡车和 SUV 为主要产品的通用，经济上受到重创。使其在经营上必须考虑中小型车和另类能源车的研发。终于在二零零八年，通用推出了雪佛兰 Cruise， 这款意在性能、油耗、外形设计和安全都不输其同级竞争车款丰田 Corolla 和本田 Civic 的紧凑型车，在二零一一年成为北美紧凑型车销量第一的车款。2011, we are the number one selling brand of, car, of passenger cars in the U.S., and that's a big change because for many years, General Motors, especially in North America, was all about trucks and SUVs. 二零一零年底，破产重组后的第二年，通用将数年前行研发而成的雪佛兰 Volt 投放市场。Volt 是一款增程式电动车，靠电力可满足每日行程在三十五英里以内人士的需要。并且不用担心纯电动车电力不足时车子抛锚的问题。Volt 好比是在世界能源危机时，作为大型汽车生产厂家的通用，给这个世界关于使用绿能能源的一个响亮的宣言。Volt 于2011年获美国汽车杂志 Motor Trend 的年度汽车奖，并在多个大型北美汽车展中获大奖这一切似乎为破产重组后的通用做了一个最好的代言。通用正在重拾人们对它的信任。For many years, we were delivering products that were expected to be bad, and in many cases they were. But now we're delivering vehicles that are unexpectedly good, and that's what's going to change opinions.